Hey everyone, Howie Fisher from Fisher's Flies. Thanks for checking in. Today I'm going to be tying up a thread blowtorch or a thread tag nymph, a thread Frenchie with a tag, whatever you'd like to call it is fine. Uh, for the th hook, I'm using a Freshwater 555 from Arex in size 14, paired with a 3.5 millimeter slotted tungsten bead in copper. For the thread, I'm using 70 denier Ultra Thread, UTC Ultra Thread in black. And I'm going to go ahead and get started with my thread right behind the hook, or sorry, right behind the bead, and break or snip it off. And immediately I'm going to go for my first material. This is Glow Bright 5, fluorescent orange. There's a number of materials uh, that are similar to Glow Bright that you could use here. And I'm going to go ahead and secure this the full length of the body to help the body be uniform and smooth. I'm going to bring this right back to the bend of the hook, just slightly past the hook point as you can see here, and then bring my thread back up to the bead. Next I'm going to grab my wire, which here is Brassy Ultra Wire in red, and I'm going to secure this to the far side of the hook away from me. It doesn't totally matter which side you do it on, but if you tie it on the far side it does uh, help wrap it forward easier. It won't push or pull that that tail material that is the tag. And I'm just going to unwind my thread by spinning it counterclockwise here and I'm going to wrap it back one more time and wrap it up forward to make sure all of my orange is covered up but also to make sure I have a smooth body. If you'd like you can taper it, you don't have to though. Then I'm going to wrap my red, th red wire forward as you see me do here to right behind the bead. Three or four wraps will do on a size 14. Then I'm going to secure it with a couple wraps over top of and in front of with my thread. And then I will helicopter this wire off. Next is my collar. Here I'm using Ice Dub UV Shrimp Pink. UV Pink works as well. Uh, use colors that you prefer. And this is acting as a hotspot collar. I'm going to go ahead and create just a little dubbing noodle, go ahead and wrap it up, and then whip finish. And I'm going to go ahead and give this two, three or four turn whip finishes, and then seat my knot and snip it off. And then what I'm also going to do here is snip the tail. I like to do this at the end, it's just personal preference, you can do it first thing if you'd like. Last step is to hit that collar with a little bit of solar as bone dry. You can also hit the body with it as well and it'll increase durability. But here you have it. This is a super simple fly, the thread blowtorch. Tie them up, fish them, let me know what you think.